three, two, one. What up, YouTube? This is your boy J Stars Vlogs, aka DIY Carver, coming back at you, back at you, speaking a little too fast, back at you with another video. Welcome back to the channel. We got another exciting review going out today from BH Gate. I was actually waiting on these. I'm actually happy they finally came in. I actually got them about a week ago, though. This. I just haven't had time to do the review. No, scratch that. I did the review, went to post it, did not like it. So now we're shooting it again. But that's beside the point. Let's go ahead and get right into it. This is an informative, informative review. This is my opinion. I'm not telling you to go out and buy them. I'm not telling you to do nothing with this information. This is just my opinion. But I will have the link below just in case y'all want to go check them out. That's on y'all though. I'm not telling you to. It's just going to be the information for y'all in case y'all want to. Now that I got that out of the way, let's get right into this. I know sneakerheads that probably waited on their phones, tablets, computers, laptops trying to get these shoes when they came out. Because I was one of them. I wanted them so bad. I wanted all three of them. And I missed on every single one. This shoe is one of the shoes that is from my childhood. This shoe, like, it was nostalgia for me, pretty much. And it didn't come out in women's. It came out in men's and kids. I don't even know if it came out in... I, I don't know because I was just looking for mine. I don't know if it came out in just little kids or if it came out in big kids too. But that's beside the point. The shoe I am talking about today is the SB Dunk Power Puffs. It came out with all three colors. Blossom, Buttercup, and Bubbles. That's going to be pink, green, and blue. In case y'all don't know which one is which. The one that I was able to get from DH Gate and it finally arrived last week. It's going to be Bubbles. And they, to me, are one of ones. There's no flaws on these. There's no nothing. The weight is good. Every single detail like on the original is there. Like I said, these are block. Buttercup, no, no, no. Bubbles, these are bubbles. The blue, I'm all over the place right now. But yes, these are bubbles. That's the insole. Insole on that one. And like I was saying, there's no flaws on these. If y'all didn't check out my last video, which almost made me stop trying to do reviews on UAs, check it out. I will have the link above. It is on the Jordan 1 Frags. That was the first ever shoe that I got with, that was a UA. And that shoe was super horrible. And what made it worse, the seller tried to offer me a $6 discount if I was to order a shoe again. Why would I do that? Why would I order a shoe from you again knowing you don't even care about this one? It just was dumb to me. That shoe was super horrible. 
the barcode that's on one of the shoes was already smudged off as soon as I took it out of the box. Stitching was wrong. It was just so much stuff wrong. Paint blotches, everything. These, I did not deal with that. I actually did not get a box with these, which I didn't care about. I, as you see behind me, I don't keep my boxes no way. So that was a plus for me. Plus, I saved a little bit of money. And I'm good with that also. Saving more money. As if I wasn't saving money already. That's the tongue. Like I said, these are the Powerpuff Nike SBs. And this is Bubbles. In y'all opinion, let me know in the comments. Is this a one or one? Am I? Is it just in my head? Like I said, I feel like it's a one or one. I actually had my one of my boys that actually does YouTube two reviews, Drew XB08. I will have his link below so y'all can check out his channel. He looked at these and he doesn't like blue, but he wants these. He actually likes these and he gave them the stamp of approval. He's been doing this a lot longer than I have. We both are sneakerheads, but he was into UAs before me and that's what made me want to do it. Because if you think about it, why buy the original shoe? If you got somebody across the water that is making it the same or better, that's just my opinion. Why spend that money? But again, to each his own. Everybody's going to do what they want to. Everybody's going to spend their money how they want to. If I can save the money, I'm going to do that. You want to save the money? Maybe this might be for you. But I'm not telling you to. I'm just giving you the information. Just keep that out there. Just keep that in the back of your head. I'm not giving you the, the go ahead to say. I'm not saying none of that. I'm not saying go do it. I'm just giving you information. Again, this is informative. But man, check out the details. And if you don't believe me, pull up the shoe on Google and y'all will see how good this shoe actually is. Look at it at the same time. Y'all can do split screen on y'all phone. Do a split screen. Have this running in the background while you're looking at that shoe. And tell me what y'all think. To me, to my friend, they're one of ones. And I'm actually happy I was able to get these. It took a little minute. I think it took like two and a half, almost three weeks. But for the price, I don't care. With no box, I don't care. I don't wear my boxes no way. I don't keep my boxes no way, as y'all can see. It's, it take up too much space. This is probably the only thing that is a little off, which it's not a big deal. These are more vibrant on the originals but this is the exact things that are in the originals so it's not a big deal who's going to be looking at these anyways you're not even going to see them unless i take off a shoe to show you so not a big deal again and it comes with the little air unit which that's supposed to be black. But you won't see that. So it doesn't matter. Oh no, what do y'all think? Let me know in the comments below. What are y'all thoughts on these? Did you cop? Were you able to cop from Nike app, Nike sneakers app? Or did you go this route? Let me know. Because for me, I missed on all three of them, so I went this route, and I was able to get them right away. 
But before y'all get up out of here, before I let y'all go, I'm going to give y'all a sneak peek of what's coming next. And like I said, I wanted all three of these. So this one just came in yesterday. And this is going to be the next video coming out next week. Wow. That's all y'all get. And that's going to be it. We are out of here. Thanks for coming back. This is your boy J Stars Boss, aka DIY Kari. If y'all like the video, give it a thumbs up. Comment to the channel. Subscribe to the channel. Peace.